Yo, what's going on guys? I'm back with another video. Now in today's video, this is actually part two. Like I'm on day two of filming this video. I was here last night and I was fishing a completely other pond in like the main part of yesterday's video, but I didn't catch anything. I lost one on a fluke. So I decided, you know what? I had my bike, which I have my bike right now. It, I don't know. It was like a 10 minute bike ride. I said, I haven't been to this pond in a long time. So I came here, fished it, caught a pretty nice one. First cast, I think it was almost two pounds. And then I caught another one, it was probably like one. And then I got three bites in the same spot doing a certain technique on a certain drop off. And that's where I just completely crushed one today that was around five pounds and another one that was around a pound. And I figured out a pattern at this pond and it's completely slaying them. All the fish are chunked up in fat. If you guys follow my Instagram, you'll see the one that I caught yesterday. The thing was an absolute football. It should have been like a half pound fish, but the thing was almost two pounds because of how fat it was. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoy. This is a good freaking video, boys. Guys, <laughs> look at that, on the tube right here. I haven't been to this pond in so long. Chunky fish. Oh, absolutely munch the tube. That has such a small head. That fish is so fat. I'm gonna get a weight on this guy. Look at him smoke the tube, this fish weighs. They're all just feeding up in this pond, I can tell. Sitting in that corner, yeah. That fish has a one, probably a under one pound body, but he is very close to two pounds. Look at that belly, that is insane. Where can I get down? This is all like overgrown. This should be fine. I'm just gonna give him a toss back. Guys, I wasn't recording for that. I was about to go take an Instagram picture and I was taking a cast for the picture and I, I casted it all the way out in the middle and a three pounder was on it and he literally jumped out of the water and tried to eat it. Dude, what is going on with these fish? Holy. All right guys, right now I have on a little Guggen Saucy Swimmer with a six weighted swim bait hook, but I'm actually gonna switch back over to the tube because I think like, I don't know, I caught that first one, I lost that one. I think that they just might be onto that today. So we're gonna try that out. Go. Get up here. Let's go, guys. Another nice fish on the tube. Look, at, dude, they're literally engulfing it. They're feeding right under that tree right there. The other one was in brush cover. This guy just chilling over there, right by the tree, right in the top of the mouth. Perfect hook set. I'm gonna go right down here, get a nice release on this fish. Just gonna give him a little toss like the last one. See you, dude. I'm back day two this is I don't know this is literally the next day I ran out of tubes so right after school today I ran to Walmart picked up some stuff and we're gonna see if we can match the same pattern that we had yesterday right here on this drop off in the steep area I'm telling you these fish are stacked here now I have the stuff to catch them with Yep, there we go, guys. That's a fish. I got one right now. Got him. Yep, good one. Really good one. To start off the day. Same exact spot, same pattern. Let's go, guys. Oh, he choked that. They all eat it so good. 
He's bleeding a little bit. Look at him choke the tube, guys. Another solid fish. We're gonna get him back. I hope he's okay. I didn't hook him too bad, but I know he's bleeding a lot. All right, that's good, he's good. Oh my god! It's a giant- oh my god! Oh god. Oh my god! That's the biggest bass I've ever caught here. Holy moly! Oh my- what the heck? There's no- Where's your camera? Oh, guys. Oh my. That's gotta be like four or five pounds. That's it? Yeah, that's it. How much? 4.54. Holy crap. Four point five five guys. Yeah. Guys, look at that fish. That is a toad. Dude, they are all feeding up right now, I swear. This is exactly what I was saying, guys. Alright guys, look at this fish. I've been fishing this pond for I moved here eight years ago. I've been fishing this pond for six years. I, this is the third or fourth biggest bass I've ever caught here. Guys, five point, I think right, right under 5.6 pounds. All right, guys, right under 4.60. Yeah, right under 4.60. All right, let's get a release in this beautiful New Jersey bass, guys. Look at this fish. Oh my God, what a fight, dude. These fish are in this pond. They always have been. It's just a miracle when you get to catch them, I swear. This is an absolute beast. There you go. There she goes, guys. Oh, what an insane fish. That's why I love fishing. Moments like that gets me so, gets me going so much. Let's freaking go, boys. What is going on guys? This is day three of the video, part three, whatever you want to call it. This is still going to be in the same video, but I'm here with Evan today. I'm at the same spot where I caught the five pounder yesterday, all the other ones. We're, we have a two bond with the titanium and the Mach 2 rod, and we're going to see if we can stay on the same exact pattern that we've been on. Got one, there we go. Let's freaking go. Right there. Right there. Straight in the... Right in the corner of the mouth. On the tube. Same spot, just different position. That's a good one, one and a half pounder. First fish of the day. We're probably leaving in 15 minutes. And we're going to go over to Hoffman Park, where I caught that good one the other day. You guys saw that on the jig. Let's get a little 